Good morning, you guys. Good morning. My day has already started. I did a house call this morning for eyebrows. So now I'm on my way back to SMC to do a um, lash lift demo. But first, I have to go pick up the car. I can't take this van. It's too big. There's no place for me to park. So I'm going to pick up the van. No, I'm sorry. I have to pick up the car and then make my way over there. So I'll check back in with you guys once I've picked up the car. Okay? All right, you guys. Let's do this presentation. I'm thinking after I do the presentation, I want to go to Mac. They have a back to Mac program and I have a bunch of containers. <laughs> Let me show you a bunch of containers to uh, get back to them. Okay. You see all that. <laughs> anyway, um, if they still have the program, you can return like six containers well, for every six containers, you can get like an eyeshadow or they might have incorporated some lip colors, but I'm mostly interested in the eyeshadow. So yes, after the presentation, let's make a phone call to Mac, make sure they still have that program before I drive over there and we will go from there. So I will check back in after the presentation. Okay. Okay, that was fun. It really was. <laughs> um, as I mentioned before, I do love, love, love teaching. I might have to branch out to other schools because a lot of those students, hold on, sorry, um, off, okay. Because they are teaching lash lifting and a lot of them have already, they're already doing it and they already have their kits. So it really isn't beneficial for me to go in there and teach if I'm looking to get students for my classes. So we shall see, we shall see. I do love going there though, because I, I did go there um, for my cosmetology and manicuring um, courses. So we'll see. I love it. And oh, actually I did get one student to sign up for my classes. So I'm excited about that. <laughs> oh, so let's, um, let's go ahead and call Mac. Cause that's the next thing I want to do. Get rid of these containers and get some products. Okay. Let's see what they have to say. Oh, awesome. Do you guys still have the Back to Mac program? Yes, the program will end March 31st. So currently everybody should still be doing it. Oh, okay. It's, it's ending March 31st? Yes. Okay, okay. I'm calling right in the nick of time. Yes, definitely. <laughs> um, what? Okay, so it's it's six containers? For every six, you get one free lipstick, lip gloss, or eyeshadow. Okay, perfect. And what time do you guys close? I'm sorry? What time do you close today? We close at 8. 8 p.m. And are you right next to the Apple store? Yes, we are. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. I'll see you soon. All right. 
okay. no problem. We'll see okay. you soon. Okay, bye. bye, -bye. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe I am just now calling them and that program is about to end. So I'm gonna get rid of these and I'm gonna look and see what other um, containers I have at home and in my makeup kit so I can get rid of them <laughs> and get some free eyeshadow. So let's, let's go to Mac. Walked in, I was like, I <laughs> I'm doing my back to Mac. You know, you get to, you just bring in all your containers okay. for every six containers. You can get like an eyeshadow or a lip yeah. gloss or lipstick. And the program in I know. After all these decades, I can't the believe it. it. No, I want seven very popular highlighter colors. Are they just brighter in general. Brighter, yes, oh, okay. in general. Okay. So tell me. Even if it's shimmery or matte, it doesn't matter. For oh, all skin tones. So I'm a makeup artist. It's not for me. It's for okay. my kit. Oh, For okay. my kits. So yes. just any color. Yes. Then. Okay. Okay, you guys. <laughs> I am in a dark parking structure. Everybody's looking for a parking space. So the goal in MAC was to pick up some highlighter colors. And I was able to get seven of them. So I have three empty containers on my account at MAC and I'm going to see if I have three more at home or in my kit or something like that. So yeah, so I'm on my way back home. What I'm going to do is check back in with you guys because I want to show you how I depot my eyeshadows to get them out of the containers and into um, another eyeshadow um, magnetic um, what is it? <laughs> little, I, it's not a container. It is a palette, a palette. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do that, okay? So I will meet you back at home. Okay, you guys, so it's late. <laughs> so I'm gonna give you the Reader's Digest version on how to depot your MAC eyeshadows. You're gonna take a knife and you're going to place it underneath the only hole that's and the eyeshadow right here. And you're gonna stick that knife underneath and pop it out, just like that, okay? okay? Next, you're going to need a small pan, a plate, a small pan with some water in it, a tea pen or a knife, you can use one or the other, and some tongs. So I'm gonna turn the oven on I'm sorry, the stove on. <laughs> and then I'm going to drop the shadow in there because what I want to happen is I want the water to boil for about a soft boil for about three to five minutes because I want the adhesive, there's, there's glue that's holding this shadow into this plastic piece. I want it to liquefy. So I'm gonna leave it in there for about, about four minutes actually. And sometimes you have to keep adding water to it. If the water disappears, you wanna add water to it. And then once it's ready, remember this is the Reader's Digest version. Once it's ready, you'll take your tongs and you'll place it in here in the plate. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take either a knife or a tea pen and you're going to pry the shadow out. If, if the adhesive is um, liquefied, it should be no problem to getting the shadow out. So once you've used the tea pen or a paring knife to pry this out of this plastic piece, what you're going to do then, you'll turn it over and you're gonna take this label off and you're gonna put it onto the shadow itself once the shadow has been removed from this black plastic piece. And the reason why you need to put either this label or some type of paper on the bottom part of the shadow, remember it's not gonna be sitting in here once you take it out, 
because there's adhesive still on there. And once it's dried, it's going to stick in your palette. So you don't want it sticking in your palette forever because you won't be able to get it out. You need to put this paper or another piece of paper on there on top of that adhesive and let it go ahead and dry and cool. And then that's it. <laughs> Okay, guys, in the comments below, let me know if you want me to do a longer version. As I mentioned, I was only going to do a Reader's Digest version on how to depot your MAC eyeshadows. In the meantime, let's say goodnight. I really appreciate all of you guys that watch my videos from the beginning to the end. As I said before, that really says a lot about your character, that you always finish what you start and I will see you in the next video. Okay, good night.